Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the women's flyweight bout between Jessica Andrade versus um, Lauren Murphy. I forgot her name for a second. But anyway, I'm going high confidence. <laughs> Jessica Andrade to beat Lauren Murphy. I just feel like Andrade, she already has proven that she ain't losing to nobody outside the best. Like, maybe she go up to 135. Like, it'd be the case. Like, well, on 135, I feel like it's more people she could lose to. 125, Valentina Shevchenko. Maybe like one other fighter. Fighter, a fighter, fighter. <laughs> one other fighter. Flyweight. I mean, strawweight. Rosa Namajunas. Rosa Namajunas barely beat her the second time. Barely beat her. I feel like they fought again. She probably might even beat or stop Rosa Namajunas again. So, odds would be good on that. Like I said, at this point, if that fight was, re was re remade, like I said, I'm not even deciding on who will win that one. So, Rosa Namajunas barely. Weili Zhang. Joanna John Chick, if, Jay Chick, if she come back. Matter of fact, Joanna John Jay Chick was is not even her best right now. So if she came back, she might beat Joanna and Jay Chick in a rematch. So it really not that many people that's actually beating her right now. So she could go up between 125 and 115 and be a get a title shot at both weight classes simultaneously. Like she's pretty solid. And Laura Murphy, she's just like she's not the most technical fighter. She's not the most talented fighter. She's kind of just grits by. And I feel like that's just not enough to beat um Aunt Jessica Draw. She could be some of these other little fighters, but the draw is strong to her, more technical to her. And it's got too much power and this is too much skill. I just feel like Murphy's is going to get teed up on and just probably get put away in the second round. She might try to grit it out. If anything, she probably get beat up for three rounds brutally. But I say she gets put away second round. And it's not like Andrade got questionable cardio or anything like that or such low fight IQ. She got a decent fight IQ. And she got a good cardio. She can go three rounds. She can go five rounds. She's not a fighter that's like, oh, you ever see her huffing and puffing after one round? Like, she, she can go rounds. So... I would not see the angle for Lauren Murphy. Murphy's offensive wrestling ain't super phenomenal or nothing. If anything, the drive should be able to address the wrestling and grappling of Murphy pretty easily. Murphy tried to tie it with her. I don't think that's going to be the best path for her either. It's not like Murphy's such great at tying people up in the clinch either. So I'm not really saying the path to victory for Lauren Murphy. If anything, I'm saying paths to defeat. So I'm going to say second round TKL for Jessica Drive. She's going to be too strong, too physical, too technical, too skilled, too talented. And I see her putting Murphy out in the second round. So in this one, I have Jessica Andrade via second round TKO.